Hi, Shane here. You're watching Sam for God. This is Mark. Check her out. So hi guys, how are you doing? Today is the 27th of February 2016. It's a Saturday and um, it's the last day of Miss Saigon in the West End. So I'm coming outside the Palace Theatre, which isn't the home to Miss Saigon. Uh, Miss Saigon Theatre is over there somewhere. We're going to go to... Oh, hello. Hello. Thank you for that. Hi. <laughs> um, nice people saying hi in my vlog. <laughs> um, but uh, yeah, basically um, I thought I'd um, vlog it because obviously I used to work at Miss Saigon for about eight months. Um, I actually, funny story, I handed in my notice at the Prince Edward Theatre where Miss Saigon was playing exactly a year ago today. Just like, it's so funny how the days turn out just randomly. I obviously didn't know at the time that it was closing a year later, but yeah, I, it just came on my time off today and I, it made me long. But um, yeah, I thought I'd vlog it because it's a special show and it's a great, you know, it's a show that everyone loves and it might be fun to just vlog the day. So I'm currently waiting to meet Lisa, she's coming with me, which should be nice as well because we both, like, that's how we met, we work there together and stuff. So it'd be nice. There she is! I can see her! <laughs> um, she's, uh, she's about to come here though. <laughs> there she is. There she is, crossing the road. <laughs> so I've been joined by Lisa now. How are you? Good. And um, this is the Miss Saigon Theatre over there, which you can't really see very well. Prince Edward Theatre. Um, it's changed a bit since we used to work there. Like that thing wasn't there, was it? No, that's all new. Yeah. I've got a digital. Like you. <laughs> But no, but it's very exciting. We're gonna have to go for food first before we go it's to the still show. Got her screaming down there, though, which is a Oh yeah, Eva over there. Forever. You will not touch him. Don't touch my boy. <laughs> <laughs> What's happened? The matinee. <laughs> it's really, really busy. <laughs> yeah. This is the final matinee. Exactly. Of Saigon. Oh my god. 2016. Exactly. It's gonna be guys going on hot to Broadway. I'm though, feeling teary-eyed now. Are you? We're <laughs> all gonna be like. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, it's gonna be a good time. It's gonna be weird. We're just saying, like, we, I've been looking forward to this for a while. But I think when, when actually, um, we actually go and watch it, I'm just gonna be like, this is so weird, very bizarre. It's a lovely theatre. Do you remember that one time when we um, relaxed on the balcony? It wasn't just only one time, but you know, there was one particular time that I remember. Yeah. Right, where are we going now, darling? Tuk 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 tuk. Okay, lead the way because I don't even know where it is. I mean, I know where it is, I just don't know. Okay, continuing. Tuk Tuk is a restaurant, it's very busy now. Tuk Tuk is a restaurant that we used to go to quite often when we um, worked at Miss Saigon because it's very close to the theatre. So if we had like, a double show, we'd go there for lunch sometimes. Um, a lot of the actors from the show. Okay, she's going to take a photo as well now. Um, yeah, so a lot of the actors from the show used to go there as well. I think that's actually how I got introduced to it because Alistair Bramlin, who used to play Chris, used to go there a lot. And then we went and we were like, it's a really good place to eat. It's very good, so that's where we're going for food. You could run like me. Run like twins. There it is. There's Tuck Tuck over there. Hopefully we'll manage to actually like get a seat and stuff. Won't be too busy. Um, very excited. Oh, it looks quite good actually. Oh, it looks awesome. As in like, it's empty. Because <laughs> normally people have food at like five. <laughs> yeah. Secret location. Oh, you can't come back anymore. Sorry. <laughs> Hello. So we're both a bit confused because it's been a while since we've been. Oh, she's found her. Is that what we used to get? Yeah. Chicken Marvelous. Perfect. Are you happy about this choice? <laughs> um, I can't remember. I used to get some kind of duck, but I can't remember exactly which one. It's very annoying. But I'm just gonna give it a shot and go for the roast duck and see what happens. Hopefully, I'll enjoy it. I remember that it was in this area of the menu. Yeah, so in the middle one. Okay, so let's just, I'm just gonna go with that then. Marvelous. Unless you want to get a full PJ. <laughs> no. <laughs> no, thank you. I'm happy, guys, because um, I got the right food. I got, I got, I got what I wanted. I used to get, which is this lovely, lovely duck and um, the egg fried rice. Very excited. What did you get, Lisa? Yay! Loving life. Like looks very nice as well. Really? That's like, like middle of 2014. Yeah. Oh my god. And like today is February 2016. Just in case you forgot. <laughs> but I'm gonna eat now, guys. I just thought I'd show you the lovely, lovely food. Uh, and this looks it's honestly one of the best ducks I've ever had, so yum yum. Do you remember? Where are you? Oh yeah. 
Who invited that very famous picture? Do you remember? Do you remember this picture? Lisa? Yeah, I remember. Where I'm in the in the, in the yeah, yeah, yeah. I was sat there. Like me, you, Amanda. Amanda, and also that's the that's this was where we found out my favorite shapes. Yeah. This was in this restaurant. It's a star. Thank you. Anyway, we just finished. We haven't just finished, but we finished our uh, food. It's currently about 36 past six. This is being very weird. Um, Lisa introduced me to um a, a guy. <laughs> What's the guy's name? Thank you so much. What was the guy's name? I introduced you to someone. Oh yeah, the singer. Oh my god. <laughs> Macklemore. You are, um, she hasn't heard of Macklemore. If you've heard of this person. Never heard of the Fresh Shop song. If you've heard of this song and the person, everyone's going to be like, yes, no, I'm okay. <laughs> Comments down below. Like, like, when did they come out then? 2007? You're just filming like. <laughs> 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 I can't see. My arm's hurting, hurry up. When did they come what? out? When did they come out? It's been around ages. Literally years. We've, um, I can't vlog anymore. What was I going to say? We're back to the theatre now um, soon. Um, and yeah, that's it. It's been a, it was a very nice lunch. Such dinner. It was a dinner, wasn't it? It was a nice dinner. <laughs> you can see her in the background. And um, yeah, uh, we've just been lolling and um, disagreeing with a couple of things. <laughs> and yeah, I'll see you in the outside of the theatre in a bit. We're going to be seeing loads of our old um, <laughs> yes. Shout out to her, me, and Ben, and anyone, all, all our old um, so. colleagues. <laughs> um, Nicole, Jason, Jose. Eddie, Jose, Eddie, um, Marie. Marie. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it, I think. <laughs> Anybody else we missed out? Sorry if we missed you out. We're going to see you all anyway. We're excited. We're literally running. <laughs> Too cold to think of oh, no. I know, I know. Um, this is over there. It's freezing. I should have worn a hat. My mum did say you should wear a hat. Mother's always nervous. Thank you so much. <laughs> that really helped for a, a second. I used to come to Cafe Nero sometimes. Not always, actually, to be honest. Oh, let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Ooh. There it is. There it is. In its all glory. It says, must end 27th of Feb. Well done. <laughs> bam, bam, bam. Well bam, bush. <laughs> Oh, we're going back to our old home. <laughs> yeah, I don't actually. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, yeah. I mean, that's, that's, that's okay. okay. That's kind of bad. I don't know what he said. It was something in the challenge. Yeah, okay, let's go in. Let's go in. Oh, there's a bungee. Hello. Hi. This is like, why are you not vlogging? Oh, there. Here on a Saturday though. Oh, um, is this a cute little? At least we know where we're going. Exactly, we know our way around. <laughs> oh, there's, 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 we'll see you in a second. We'll see you in a second. So it's cool. I can't vlog here. I really can't vlog here. <laughs> Just waiting for him to arrive, and then, oh, then we yeah. Uh, and then it's yeah. gonna be. Relaxed. Then it should be a little bit more relaxed, but we just don't know when he's coming. I've vlogged a little bit. Okay. Hey! <laughs> <laughs> you don't like it already? Yeah. Oh, no! Oh, I'm so sorry. It's so busy. Where are we going? What, where are the tickets? Then? We are in Lowsham. Which? Oh, now, do you remember where that is? is this yeah, that's that way. Yeah. yeah. We know where we're going. I thought I'd speak. I know, right? It's really hard to vlog here because of how many people there are. Um, 
Yeah, there's like cameras around. I'm guessing it's because of press. <laughs> Hello, Jose. Do you want to say hi? <laughs> the lovely Jose. Um, yeah. Oh, it's not all quiet. Everyone's so busy. I know. I know. I can imagine. If we were here, should we go out? Actually, Lisa. Remember many so a nights where you had to. Oh yeah, camera match is coming here. It's coming tonight. Tonight, yeah. Do you remember many a nights having to hold this door Cam, open? <laughs> you, Yo, Cam. I know. Oh. Yeah. Do you remember the, the amount of times you had to just open, uh, open that door and yeah. keep it open? Stand here and just be like, like that was that was what we did for some time. Just like for three hours. <laughs> Don't I was, miss working here. That was naughty, and like I'd come and visit you sometimes. That was a very nice friend. Come and play in here. I know. Oh yeah, here. This is a place where loads of uh, everyone's busy. Over there. Oh, yeah. 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 Again. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's everyone's service tonight. Understand if you like this a lot. I'm going to put a white wine down. We here normally when everyone's watching the show, so we like see it very yeah. quiet. Yeah. Oh, we're on that side. Yeah, exactly. Thank you very much. Would you like to come? Would you want to come? We don't. No, we don't. Hi, don't. I'm just going to say hi. Let's go. Go to the girls' day. Um, no, oh my oh, god! That's a five pounds. Hi, darling. Hello. Oh, god, Come and see you when you left. Yeah, hopefully. In the the <laughs> Thanks, yo. Thanks, that was really so <laughs> That was really That was awesome. I thought I was going to get a little on. It was like, what? <laughs> It was awesome. Um, it's because like when you're on the bar, not that was a very good bar person. You probably were a lot better than me. But like when you're on bar, you and when you're very busy, I, I you never look at the people you're serving. I never did anything. Which just didn't work. She was just like, no, no, no. this is probably why you were so good because no, no, no. you were just like, it's like well, this is probably I'll why I've got great hair. Fine, I'll just do my. I'll just take it easy and nice and blah blah blah. Yes, it's good though. It's really neat. Um, where are we exactly, sir? I must admit, I never looked at anyone in the eye either. I was just really. Like, yeah, there you go, yeah. I used to talk to people when I, when, when, when I was like on school. Yeah. When, uh, when you were on fire, did you speak? Do you remember that one time I sent someone to you who was going. <laughs> we were both in the, in the foyer and I sent a guy to come to you and talk about the fact that you were about to <laughs> yeah. lead or something that <laughs> weekend for your time. He was like, well, make like, sure you come and you know, say that to my friend. He, he did. He did like, that. People would come over to me and be like, oh, yeah, that girl. <laughs> You're like, great, thanks. I just love people. I love people though. I love the fact that people. when we used to pretend about this in absence? Yes, and I was so bad. And, and what did you do? I couldn't, I don't think I did. You, James did once did one. James did and then hilarious. He, he like, did Irish. Oh, that was it. Oh my god, the Japanese. <laughs> <laughs> like, I can't do this. Like, oh, no, 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 thank you. Thank you. Yeah. But you did write in saying, oh, in saying, oh okay, because I was probably like, no, it's fine, just take yeah. a video. I mean, somebody insists. <laughs> Um, so we've just met. Who we met? I, I didn't get his name, but it was um, the father of one of the Tams, one of the old Tams, yeah. uh, James. Uh, and apparently he wasn't breaking it. <laughs> anyway, he was so lovely. He got a couple of big pictures of us and stuff. And it was really nice to talk to him. And stuff. He's watching it from the dresser. Yeah. yeah. Um, anyway, what, what, oh, going back to like working here, what were some of your highlights? Um, just messing around. <laughs> Just being rebels, I think that was the anything apart from being like rebels was not fun. It, yeah, I mean it was just nice for like the social, especially if you're not from around here and then you come down here and you start working in the theatre. It's the perfect so social life, isn't it? Yeah. And, and yeah, everyone was yeah. so lovely. Uh, all my all the people I worked with were like amazing. Um, I've always like said that I've had not the best memories from working here, but that wasn't because of the people. I love the people. The people that I worked with were the reason I stayed here for like that long. Like I wouldn't have been here that long otherwise. Um, Thank you. Shall we? Um, what was I going to say? Oh, that was, yeah. From there. <laughs> what was I going to say? Do you remember that one time? 
When um, you know we had those aprons, and uh, <laughs> I think I think I gave you gave me my you gave yours to me, and I was wearing it as a cape, as a like Superman or something. <laughs> yeah. And I ran downstairs because I was trying to get ice cream. So I went to the store to get ice cream. <laughs> you didn't have an apron, <laughs> and I was like, oh my god, I've got these apron. Yeah. How is she gonna like? And I was and like, was she needs like, to get it before she goes in public and manages to see her. And it was oh, so many, so many. I was like, how do you have this apron? <laughs> <laughs> like, oh, no. I was just like, sorry, I still have it. It's a cape. I'm Spider-Man, oh, Superman, yeah. Superman. Spider-Man, you have a cape. Oh, and the time when um, me and James abducted your hat. <laughs> oh, that was not a fun time, though, was it? <laughs> Locker and um, in the in the locker room, and then we took it into the ice box, and we like you put ice on it and everything. You like, put ice on it. Send me and, pictures uh, of it. Took pictures of sent it like with a ransom note, like <laughs> million pounds. Pay? I know, and you got Joey to send it, I think, because like he didn't think yeah. he, he didn't have, he didn't have a number. Like, like send it from WhatsApp, so I still saw her picture. Yeah, I, so so I knew. Kind of went a bit wrong. Yeah, which is I love that. And then you, she had my hat for like a week, and I was like, yeah, I need that. Holiday. I when I find it. Because she was <laughs> the things that happen in this theatre. Anyway, I just spotted as well another little memory <clears throat> up on the top of that room. Mm -hmm. So when I used to count the money, yeah, after doing the ice cream, thing, yeah, yeah. I used to count the money up, up here, right? And okay. I used to sit at the top of the stairs yeah. in the ice box room. Okay, yeah, yeah. And I used to look out the windows and I used to watch people partying on top of the roof. Oh, okay. So you used to just and enjoy. I used to have parties on the top of the roof and I used to live in that box. Oh, that's so cool. Yeah. I think we have to count Yeah, people watching is always quite fun. Am I quite cold? My hands are too really cold. Cold? Is that nice? Or is it like making you more cold? You're warm, so it's making me like it's making my hands not cold. Can I like? Okay. Anyway, that's it. We're gonna go to our seat soon, but just thought we'd like reminisce a few times. A few times. We're gonna look Yeah. We both met him. Yeah. Many times. We've seen him around the as well. Yeah. That's Cameron Magnus, by the way. Yeah, because on my first night here, they were like, oh yeah, you probably won't be looking after him because it's like your first night. Because you were doing, because you were doing hospitality. I was doing hospitality, so I was like in one of the rooms with all the champagne and the glasses already, just in case he came in, or like just in case someone else came in. And then he, like, like someone came in and was like, oh yeah, Cameron's gonna be here in like uh, five minutes. So I was like, sorry, what? <laughs> I was like so prepared and he came in and all the press followed him and I was like, Hiya! Champagne! <laughs> 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 But you know, he was happy okay. with your... Oh, that's right, no, I didn't think he you would just tried that. He kind of didn't speak to me the first few times yeah, okay, about him, sorry. and then, then after a few times he would like, speak to me and say hi and stuff. Yeah. But then she left and then I became a very busy man. Yeah. Busy man, of course. He owns like a million theatres. Yeah. He's only recently bought the one in Billy, the Billy Elliot theatre. That's why I've had him with me. So. Yeah. He's yeah. always been very pleasant. Yeah. yeah. Lovely man. I mean, the one, one, one time I met him was really lovely. I've seen him around, but I've only met him once and he was lovely. He's a picture of me and Cameron. <laughs> This is the secret Harry. Yeah, yeah. Just uh, casually chilling. This door actually was a door that I stood on a lot. This was like my door. Um, made fun of the fact that I had to stand. Hello. <laughs> Sorry, I'm just vlogging. <laughs> um, I'm yeah. just lost. How are you? <laughs> no. <I'm> okay. <laughs> Good. I'm glad you found what you need to be. Um, also, yeah, I used to um, stand outside the store a lot. Like every, a lot of the times, every week, I just put it here. It was like my position. Thank you. Lisa's gonna do something. We did it. We just did we did something that we shouldn't we shouldn't be doing. Not as non ushers I can't believe we did that yet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is there anybody on your here? Say hi. Let's go say hi really quickly, why not? Where are you? I'm going to Austria. I'm going to Austria. Water. I've got loads of water in my in my thing. Um, it's nice and warm here, though. I like it. And see, hello, happy birthday! Yay! <laughs> You're right. I'll let you serve. 
<laughs> so cute. Guys, we literally just like walking around saying hi to all our like little colleagues and stuff. It's so funny. There's Anna over there, she's lovely. Hello Anna! Literally such a bad influence. <laughs> we should not Oh my god, oh my god, I can't believe we're doing this. <laughs> How do you feel about being so cheeky in life? Oh, I just got lost. Yeah, we just got lost. We just thought the door was like, um, we have to get these other door, don't we? Who else, who else can you see that we know? Um, oh, I don't know that, that girl over there. I don't know who that is. Um, yeah, there's so many new ushers that we don't know. Hi, honey. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I'm like, <laughs> I'm like, oh, I'm like <laughs> Nice to see you. Hello. You too, honey. Do you want to say hi to the vlog? Hello! Hermie is such an awesome person. She was one of the reasons that I love working is, here. Hermie is the glue in this place. Literally, yeah. That's, I, I, if, if it wasn't for her, I would have left so much earlier than I did. <laughs> Why is she talking? I'm being nice. You should be happy. Hey, enjoy. Have a good week? Yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah, sure. Hey. Oh, yeah. Look at We're this. We're in the auditorium. First class service. First class service by the lovely Nicole. <laughs> Yay! Go, Nicole. <laughs> yeah, of course I am. You know me. Yay! Huh? No, of course. <laughs> Everyone's like. We're in our seats now. In a. Um, in the loge. In the loge. Number dos. Number dos, which is a place I've never sat in before. It's, it's nice. Um, this is kind of where we used to get, remember whenever people were actually sat here, we used to actually have to bring them here, like walk them to yeah, the villages, whereas everyone else just said, go there, and like that was it. Um, it's a sold out show, obviously, not a single ticket left. Uh, it's the grand, not the grand ticket, <laughs> the um, grand circle. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah and then, Shawnee will be up there. Yeah, shout out to Shawnee, I know you're Shawnee. here tonight, so if we want to meet you, so let us know. Hopefully, if you will see you. Obviously, you won't let us know because you've seen it after we've yet. Basically, <laughs> we hope to see you, is what we're saying. But yeah. Um, yeah, quite a few people are here, quite a few people I know apparently are up there as well. And that's there. Are you excited? I'm sorry. I'm really excited. Are you? I'm a bit sad, but excited. Yeah, it your red kind of matches the... <laughs> you're like, yeah, camouflage. <laughs> I like it. So yeah, it's me in the, the Prince Edward Theatre, a place where I spend many a day and evenings working and running away from mice and talking to strangers and making things <laughs> up about my life and other friends' lives and I was just yeah. a weirdo. <laughs> um, but that's how I survived and it was fun times and I'm just so happy to be here for one last time it's weird. Do we know any of those people? No, there's two ushers over there that we don't recognise. Um, but they're well being well. Oh, there's Paris. Oh, okay, there's Paris over there. Who? Um, who? You don't know her. It's, ah. a, it's, it's someone I know. Okay. <laughs> She's just waving at me and vlogging as well. That's hilarious. Do you see her in that lurch over there? Yeah, yeah, I was like, yeah, yeah. uh, <laughs> I don't know who she was. Bye. <laughs> anyway, show's starting. Bye. Okay. Hi guys, we're here Hello. with the lovely Ben. You can see yourself. Ben. Can I you? Oh, it's video. Just, Thank you, sir. Video and You're so tall, Ben. I mean, I know. <laughs> but anyway, oh, no. We need to go somewhere about. Yeah, we need to go somewhere more. Um, yeah, let's just kind of continue going. Right. You probably would have seen Ben in some of my previous vlogs. Um, also, it's Kirsty. Can I say hi? Um, but yeah. Hello, how are you? Yeah, you're good. Yeah. yeah. Tomorrow, we're here as well. <laughs> see ya. Um, how are you feeling then about tonight? Very stressed, very Aww. stressed. Come on, let's get you to the bar. Okay, we're going to the bar now. How are you? Yeah, enjoy. Okay. Okay. Look how cute this is though. It's got our names on it as well. Lisa. <laughs> oh, hair we did that. It must have been, yeah. Um, right, do you want to... Um, that's so cute. Thank you so much to Ben and Hermie and everybody at the Prince Edward for looking after us. Like, I feel like royalty coming back because I've got so many people I know, who I know working here and stuff. And, oh, I love my favourite Ben chocolate ice cream. It's normally four pounds, but we have to have it with you because it's supposed to work here. Very, very grateful. We're using um, secret toilets, which are very nice and private here. But sorry, we can't tell you where they are. Exactly. You, 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 it's a secret location. <laughs> yeah, that's it. That's why I'm going to stop vlogging now. <laughs> We've got our ice creams. The vanilla for Lisa. Lisa. For Lisa. And chocolate genie. Did you get our no? No, that's good. Oh, no, I left it as well. Oh, we filmed it. We got it for Yeah. But yeah, we're very excited. How did you feel about Act 1? I oh, loved it, it was brilliant. Um, it's so nice seeing it like in the audience. Yeah. I know. It's, you actually, I know. 
But I can't help but still have those like points in my head, like where it's like yeah. Lake Summer's point. Literally, the yeah. bit of the lake coming, smell is like grand circle. circle. Lake Summer's, I was like, no, thanks. I was like, sorry, I just had to do it. But um, it's such a good show. I've forgotten how good it was. Like, it's, it's a different experience watching it properly like this, as Lisa said. We have such a good view as well, and the energy of the crowd. Like, everyone's absolutely yeah. loving it. It's Everyone's that one's clapping. That makes a all difference. The time, yeah. Like, every single song. That. And it's such a nice atmosphere. It really, really makes a difference. It's so good every show up for me. It's a sold out show. Everyone's, every seat in this auditorium has been taken. So that's awesome. I'm excited to eat my ice cream now and watch Act 2. And um, I wonder if it's going to be in surprise at the end because that'll be fun. extraordinary experience and how lucky we are that 25 years after we did the original show that we had the chance to do this marvellous new production and by <laughs> we here now in Europe will be facing far far greater flight of refugees in this in these times the great musicals are timeless and that is certainly true the show just finished. There was Cameron on stage. Uh, uh, what's his name? Claude Michel. Schoenberg. Yes, there you go. Um, it was awesome. It was a grand like finale. It was awesome. Really, really good. Emotional. Everyone was loving it. What did you think? Um, just so glad to be a part of it. Yeah, yeah. same. We, I saw the very, very first. Because she started from the, from the beginning yeah. of Miss Saigon, yeah. And then I saw the big um, exciting night. What was that? Uh, 25th anniversary. Yeah, that I was there for as well. You were there for that, that, was, well. that was amazing, yeah. yeah. Finishing night as well. So and here's cool. Nicole, yeah. who is all she, she's also been from, from, from the beginning of the Miss Saigon, so like a, a Miss Saigon legend. Yeah, it's been so good. Last night. <laughs> when we worked here, it was like to get out of here and now, and now we can't leave. We're like the last hey. people in the dress. Hey. <laughs> We're not leaving anymore. Oh, this this theatre is just like oh, so many memories. Yeah. So guys, I'm home now. Um, it was such a good show, such an emotional show. Miss Saigon seeing it for one last time. Um, yeah, um, I also I didn't get to properly vlog at the end, sorry about that, for many reasons. One of them was that I was talking to like my old colleagues and just like, you know, talking to people and it was just very busy and stuff. Also, uh, my memory card ran out of space. <laughs> I filmed a lot today, more than I expected to, so, you know, it's going to be a long vlog. But um, yeah, just a few last thoughts, I guess. Also, I was able to just film little bits of the finale, not the finale, but like the kind of curtain call, which is very good. So I hope you enjoyed that. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to say a few words about the show and stuff. Um, it was so good. It was honestly probably my favourite time watching the show. Um, everyone in the cast was amazing, of course. This is a show that I've seen like so many times, hundreds of times, because I used to work there when, you know, the show was on. Well, obviously the show has been on for the past like two years, but I worked there from July of 2014 until March of 2015. Yeah. Um, so that's about eight months, eight, nine months, and yeah, I got to watch it pretty much every night, or at least like parts of it anyway. And so it's a show that's incredibly familiar with me, and um, it's very weird because like watching it tonight, like I know obviously every, I know, I know everything, I know every single word they sing, everything is in my head. So it feels weird watching it, but it still felt amazing. Like it's an amazing show. I got to really appreciate it tonight for what it is as a show, Miss Saigon. Because, I mean, I got to see it as well before I started working here and I liked it. Before I started working at the Prince Edward, I'd, I'd seen it a couple of times before and obviously then I started working there and I got a bit sick of it because I was having to see it every night and stuff and that happens when you have to see something <laughs> more than like every day. You just kind of can't help but get sick of it. But, it, you know, it was good that I hadn't seen it for so long, like nearly a year now, because it just, it was very fresh for me. I like kind of tried to at least watch it with them. Um, what did they, they say? New eyes and open open eyes? No, fresh eyes. I think that's it. <laughs> it's just a really good show and I honestly got emotional quite a few times throughout the show. Um, everyone was amazing. John John Riums uh, is just fantastic. One of the best performers I've ever seen on stage. He's so just amazing as of all of the engineer. Um, and he's so I'm happy that he's going on to Broadway because he is just like, yeah, Broadway audiences are going to love him. He's 
amazing phenomenal and he was so good tonight as well i just i love him and he's such a lovely man as well like I, i've met him a few times when i used to work there we like crossed paths a few times um, at like parties and events and stuff and he's such a lovely man so humble and and lovely to chat to um eva noble zada as well um she's amazing as well um yeah it was, it was so good to see her again uh, such an amazing voice so much so much emotion and stuff she's so good i love that you will not touch him don't touch my boy i can't sing obviously but i love that bit this is the hour like so many bits in the show made me cry tonight the new twee who i don't know like i can't i don't know who he is because it's a different twee who uh, to the one who used to play twee back in um back when i was working there so you would have seen his name and the cast thing that i showed earlier but he was really good very different um but really really good his acting was very intense and very believable very emotional i really enjoyed his performance um the new Chris, who's been in the show since like last May, I believe, um, it was the first time seeing him. Um, <laughs> not, I wasn't the biggest fan of him, but he's got a really good voice, really good voice. I think I, I think I prefer Alistair Brammer though, but it was good to see a different portrayal. So yeah, I was good. Also, Siobhan Dillon was on as um, Ellen, my first time seeing her. Apparently, she's been off the whole week, even like today. Today's matinee, she didn't do. Um, so it was good to act that she actually managed to be there for the last show and stuff and she was really good I, I loved her performance and I've never been a fan of Ellen as a character But she really um, her performance was really really good and really moved me It was just great to be um, uh, in the theatre again for one last time and see everyone um, everybody was so up for it as well It was uh, like a full house and you, Like they were getting like full-on like big applauses after every single show not every single show sorry every single song <laughs> And that was amazing like the atmosphere was amazing electric i don't want to be like <laughs> pretentious but the atmosphere was honestly really really good and um it just made the whole thing better like i just kind of felt proud to have worked there and to be there you know for the final night i really really enjoyed tonight and um i was also very happy to be there with lisa because as i said before that's how we met two years ago we met working there and uh obviously we have a lot of memories in that theater with that show because we were there for like a few months together working and stuff so it just made sense to be there for the final night with her and because we both understood like so many things about the show and like the thing is when you work front of house in a theater in a west end show and that shows on like every single night you can't help but have like inside jokes about it like there's so many bits in the show like pretty much for every bit in the show in miss saigon all the front of house people have like little jokes about it and stuff because that's what you do when the show's on and you're just kind of bored outside waiting doing nothing waiting for the interval or whatever we just kind of talk about the show sometimes not always but sometimes you know you talk about the show you, you make up dance routines to the like songs and stuff you just have fun with the show the show just becomes part of your everyday life and when i work there the, the songs were stuck in my head constantly i mean literally constantly and i was so angry at the time because i hated the fact that they were always in my head but obviously now they're gone so it was really lovely to hear them again it's such a beautiful score as well it was so so good to see everyone like some of my old colleagues who still work there um massive shout out to ben because he gave us free ice creams and like drinks and stuff in the interval and it was just so lovely to see him also hermy as well um nicole uh just everyone like i, I can't i don't want to miss out people's names because we saw everyone like loads of people tonight who we used to work with and stuff and that's the thing i've said it before and i want to say it again tonight because um you've probably heard me complain a few times in videos and stuff about my time at the princess with theater and i just want to make it clear again that you know i i loved working there because of the people the people my fellow ushers my colleagues were some of the best bunch of people i've ever worked with like probably literally the best people i've ever worked with i loved it you know it was every day just having them around me just made it worthwhile and it made it more it made it bearable they were all such great people it was almost like it were like a very like like big family i know that's very cheesy but it really was and um it's like only people i worked with at the principal theater understand the situation that we were in because you know yes the managers weren't very nice and i still obviously don't like the managers very much um or like the front of house supervisor who doesn't work there anymore well she's good so i didn't see her tonight um but yeah i think the fact that we all kind of were in the same situation and kind of kind of made us kind of bond a bit more the fact that we all didn't really like our managers i guess anyway that's a different story also one last thing i want to say um i met a couple of people who watched my videos tonight um alex was one of them i didn't get to see sean unfortunately so sean like leave comments down below if you were there sorry that i didn't see you i don't know where you were i think you was you said somewhere in the grand circle but yeah i saw alex and it was really nice to see you also kirsty obviously who also vlogs um i talked to her a bit in the interval i just want to say quick like apology for like not spending too much time with you because obviously like the interval was quite short like it was only like 15 minutes 
minutes and um, we had so many people that we wanted to talk to in the interval like I wanted to go and see my old colleagues and stuff so I, I would have liked to have spent more time talking to everyone but like unfortunately I couldn't just because I wanted to make the most of the small time that we had in the interval to go and say hi to everyone and stuff but yeah that is pretty much it I think that is quite appropriate for me to end this vlog next to this poster which is from the 25th anniversary show in September of 2014 which I worked um, and yeah it was like because they was filming it that night as well so I actually stole this poster from the grand circle because they had posters like this everywhere at the theatre that day it was like a massive deal um, watch that like there's a performance there's performance of like, videos of it on YouTube if you want from that night it was an amazing night and also the party after party that night was also amazing that's where I got to like meet Cameron Macintosh and talk to him and stuff and yeah it was a really good night anyway um, so it's, it's, it's funny that this is still on my wall in my room and it has been there since September of 2014 just for the laws like a nice little memory of my time working at Miss Saigon but anyway guys I hope you enjoyed watching this show leave comments down below if you like Miss Saigon or if you were at the last show or if you just enjoyed the vlog and yeah thank you so much for watching as always and I'll see you next time bye